screw. So the first thing that you will need is a grid change over switch. It's very simple to install. It simply takes power from the grid into it, takes power from another device, which power station, uh, to it, and then it goes out to your consumer board to power your home. Currently, it's the generator's off, the main supply is on. I'll change that to mains off, generator on, and with a bit of luck, all the lights will come back on. Are we ready? Let's do it. So my first step, grid's off. I'm gonna turn off all my sockets in my property. All my circuits are off in the property. I'm gonna activate my inverter, which is gonna activate the power system. Inverter's on, those lights are on, which is great. Initiate my changeover switch. My property's now being powered, and then I'm gonna turn on my heating system. I'll do that first. Good. Now, if you have a look up here on the shunt, this is the heating system booting up, 57 watts. If you look at the heating controls on the wall, they're already powered on. And if we come over to the boiler, the boiler is powered. Now, what I can now do is improve things even further. I can turn the lights on. I can turn my sockets on. I'll put on my entire property, which we're running off the system. 